Hello everybody, Georgie Burns here. Today I'd like to show you how I made this card. This stamp set is actually a free stamp set at a celebration. If you place an order for £45 or more, you can get this one free. Let me zoom out a little bit now. Yeah, you can get this one for free and it is a red rubber stamp I haven't even put the stickers on yet and it is I think quite a pretty stamp so to make this card I'm going to change the colours and I'm going to use a uh, purple posy so I've got a white card base of eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths a piece of purple posy which is three and three eighths by five and no three and five eighths by five and three eighths I have also got a piece of white card measuring five by three oh. five yeah five inches by three and one eighth and that will go there and then I've got uh, some purple posy and this measures three inches by two and a quarter and I'm using the opposite end for the top which measures three by three and that will just stick on there like that with the cake on top for my sentiment I have got lots of sentiments like this time to celebrate you can't see it there you are. Time to celebrate. Um, I have quite a few of these stamps where uh, dies where the background. I've had them for ages. I'll show you my book. They are, as you can see, I've cut them out in white and coloured card just so you can see which what it is I've got just because with love especially for you many happy returns thank you happy birthday just for you best friend on your special day Christmas wishes hugs and kisses warmest wishes it's time to celebrate which is the one we're using make a wish best wishes and thinking of you so I thought I would use them as I've got them and inside I didn't stamp anything because time to celebrate this could be for anything that you need a cake for so we should get started first of all we're going to stamp the oh I've got a scrap here and we're going to stamp the cake because we need to cut the cake out and I'm going to stamp this in memento black ink down there I've only got one stamp out I shall put it away right and we have just to colour that in but I'll leave that a minute or two to dry and what we'll do we'll stick down the uh, card so what I'm going to do is stick these down first So I opened it. My sister gave me this glue last night and told me to try it out. So I said I would. Comes out quite fast. Maybe I've got it open too much. Right, 
I'm leaving a little border all the way around. I did put too much glue on that. open it a little bit All right, and we're going to that's place this bottom here like that now on this one I did put a bit of silver washi tape on to hide this join so this time I'm going to put a bit of silver, let's straighten that end out, it's a silver glittery one I found, this. I don't use washi tape very often, so I thought I'd use it, and just a little piece. Better than using um, card, I just thought I'd use washi tape. Alright, and now we're going to stick that on there. No, we're not, we're going to stick it on here. That's it. I told you I don't know what I'm doing. even border all the way around I don't think I like this glue only time will tell Stick this on the base, leaving an even border all the way around and straight. don't like this glue. I shall stick to my own cosmic shimmer. Right, so we'll put that to one side. What we'll do is colour in our cake. I've got uh, all these blends ready. Right, this one is light soft sea foam and this is just for the stand cake stand and I'll just colour that in just makes it look like glass Right, put them all 
I also use them. Alright, I am going to use petal pink on the flower, uh, on the cake itself. So this is the light petal pink. Make sure you get all the cake. In between the flowers and the leaves and Right, we've got the dark and what we're going to do is just swipe in from the edges on both sides and make it longer as you go down the same on this tier gone quite well that that gives it makes it look like it's round right with the flowers we're going to do the leaves in dark old olive I could have had one of these done before but then the video would have been over so quick They need to be lighter. So I'm going to use light old olive just on where the buds are on the leaves. Where the buds are. And this one as well. Uh, 
and I'm going to use um, lovely lipstick I think uh, which is this one so this lovely lipstick lovely parade that was this one must be light lovely lipstick that will do and that will colour in these little I don't know what they are, decorations. And the flowers, we're going to call it in, colour in, in purple posy. So we'll just go around the whole flowers. And this one. Oh, found a leaf I missed. Now we've got Purple Posy Dark, we're going to colour that middle in dark. What we're also going to do is go around and colour where the petals are folded over. There's quite a few of them. And then we're going to take the light and just blend it in. Now, what I'm doing here, I'm only going to colour in the bottom half of it because it is sitting in between two tiers of the cake. So that just gives it like it's falling over in the middle or folded over in the middle should I say you can see that it's darker at the bottom where it's folded over and I need green again to colour this leaf And what we're going to do next with that is cut it out. Let's put these away. Grab our scissors. And we're just going to cut the whole cake out. I just read that in uh, February, I think, if you want, 
you can buy dies to go with this cake but they're not releasing them until February doing around the flowers is just going around the I'm not cutting each individual flower out I'm just going around the top of the flowers You know, never coloured the buds in. on the card. And there we have it. One cake. Now that didn't take long, did it? Let's just colour these. That's in up here, one there, and two here. And then this will go on dimensionals and sit down there with the sentiment sat there. So let's get some dimensionals out. and place that straight and in the middle down there and then the sentiment take the backings of all these we will place to do I don't think you can see it on this one I put Winker Stella on the flowers so I'm just going to cover these flowers in Winker Stella But 
this one Costello on changes the colour a bit. And it's a bit pinker. Oh yeah. It dries out, it comes back to purple. And I've just got to add some gems. So on this one I put one there. One there. And one. Well, I hope you like them. If you do, give us a thumbs up. You can't really see that purple one, can you? Oh, yeah. If you do, give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of my videos, please share. Uh, please subscribe. And if you press the bell icon, you'll be notified of all, any more videos I upload, which is usually on Monday, Wednesday and Friday. All I can say is thanks for coming and I hope to see you again soon.